I'm gonna say no sunglasses for you. Something strange happened. Well, I've actually never had this happen to me before. I was opening up the, the Disney app and it said that some of the mobile services are not available right now at the moment. They're down. I've never had that happen before. But we're here at Hollywood Studios to do whatever Alexa wants to do. But most importantly, we're going to Trails End tonight, which is the whole brand new menu. We wanted to go to dinner and check out the whole place out. Casey will be joining us later tonight. Woo! Let's go. Let's go. Can't I'm wait. I'm most looking forward to the green beans. I'm looking forward to the ribs. Mm -hmm. And just to see what Trails End looks like. But first and foremost, Time to have fun at Hollywood Studios. Very intrigued to see the crowd attendance today. It has been up. It has been up for sure, especially this week. Crowds have sort of kind of been back. Oh wow, they've even got advertisements here at Hollywood Studios for food and wine. Check that out. We're entering the park right now at about 4.40. Got another after afternoon vlog coming at you guys. As soon as we entered, Alexa demands what? Where are we going? To the vault section. Like uh, the... Celebrity Five and I, where I used to work. Oh, you know what's crazy? We were looking at Casey's photos last night, and she has so many pictures up here. I was like, ah, oh, foreshadowing. He used to work there. I don't think that's really foreshadowing, but... No. Uh, this actually just kind of came out. I saw this in Magic Kingdom the previous week. These are the what 70s. Is this? This is it's Muppets. Scary. Yeah, right? Muppets is terrifying. <laughs> And you know what, speaking more of Casey, because you're going to see Casey tonight. Also, how come you didn't um, hang with us in Wisconsin? I don't think we've ever addressed that. Oh, because I went to Kansas City for Taylor Swift. All you Swifties, you know, you got to travel as far as you can um, to see her. <laughs> if you have more tickets, let Alexa let know. Let her know. But uh, speaking of Casey, we were looking at her pictures. Hollywood Studios had a parade. Like a legit parade. They need to bring that back. Like it was nuts. But it was like when she was eight. It was cool. Hollywood Studios needs a parade. They need something else. Sure. Oh my gosh, Alexa wants to drink. We might be going to Oga's Canteen. Try to see if there's walk-ups. If not, we can just go to Baseline. Right? Or, oh, hold on, there's something in my eye. So you know, I, I feel like if people are saying the Disney parks are empty, at least this week, it's just not true. I mean, look at this. It is just not true. There is people here that I think the average wait time posted right now is about about an hour. Slinky, Rise, they're all about 90 minutes. So it's not like what we've seen uh, j during uh, July 4th. The crowds are definitely up. Like look down sunset here. This week is, is definitely not empty. Definitely not empty. We did get Oga's for 520, so that is a plus. We haven't done that in forever, and I think they actually have uh, some snacks that we've never tried there. But like, look at look at Sunset. I mean, I would say the crowds are up, but we just got a reservation for Oga's, so like, it's not, they're not bad. I feel like people are just coming here for the rides, less more of the, the experiences. Like, they're trying not to spend money. That's why a lot of reservations for food are always open. So I think that's what's going on. People are choosing to save money by not doing those. I'm actually kind of happy that we're going to Oga's because I don't even know the last time I've been there. It's been a while. The it's last been a hot time second. I was there. It's probably with you. With my friends. It's probably with you. No, I dropped you guys off. Yeah. <laughs> I haven't been here in like a year and a half. Speaking of old entertainment here at Hollywood Studios, who remembers the big stage they had here for Star Wars? Oh yeah. Do you remember that? Yeah. Like that was cool. It's just like there's a whole lot of no entertainment now. And I say that as Daisy Duck is walking past over there. Well, it was cool. The whole march they would do, like, mm. I'm not a Star Wars person. I've never really seen the movies, but like, that was an experience. It was. Like Oga's Canteen's about to be. Cantina. By the way, guys, they moved Max's meet and greet. It's actually over here by Echo Lake. It used to be in the front of Galaxy's Edge, but I did see a picture of Max meeting over here, so I just want you guys to be aware if you're heading to meet Max. Have you ever seen a Goofy movie? Um, yes, I have. Oh, yeah, I have, I didn't know that. It's a good movie. Keep an eye out. This is where Max could be meeting as well. There are some character attendants here, so... You see him? Yeah. It is Max. This is going to be Max's new spot. We're going to catch him as he comes on over. Do you want to meet him? No. 
Why? <laughs> I don't like to meet characters. <laughs> We're gonna walk right by him. I'll wave to him okay. as he walks past me. That's All right. about it. Max! Power line, power line, power line. <laughs> we love you. That's Goofy's kiddo. He's <laughs> so cute! I freaking love Max! Wow, what a happy guy. I know, right? Oh my gosh, Donald Duck too! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Oh, Donald meets over here now. Okay. So Donald Duck is over here now. I like how they're like always constantly changing this. Sweet. Right when Indiana Jones dumps too, he's gonna get a huge line. We gotta get out of here, we gotta go. <laughs> Star Tours, five minutes. Alexa, what did you just tell me? It reminds me of Dave Portnoy, how he thought this was Galaxy's Edge and he like thought it was the best ride ever. <laughs> they were like, that's not even the ride yet. Looks like we still got the walls up over here too. You know what's crazy guys? I feel like this whole, tri whole trip, Alexa hasn't even asked me to take one Instagram photo. Are you, are you sure your Instagram is still alive? Well, we've just been too busy. Let's go, go, go. I have some um, pictures that I haven't even posted from the crew, so I've got a backlog of pictures. She's almost to like 12,000, so if you go follow her, go follow her right now. As soon as I said that, Alexa said, okay, let's stop and get a picture with Goofy. I did not say Instantly. that. Instantly. Yes, she did. You said, take one with Goofy. Because <laughs> she was going to go somewhere else. I was like, take one with Goofy. Goofy is so tall. It's like six foot eight or something. All right, you ready? Okay. She's nervous for sure. Can, I go? Can we go? <laughs> yeah. Goofy. Hello. Yeah, oh my gosh, I'd love to. Picture. Your camera. Here, look at mine first. Three, two, one. Say Instagram. Woo! Yeah, I don't know what to say. Not Instagram. She didn't like my photos. <laughs> Bad angles. I guess they're not getting posted. You're only gonna see them on the vlog. I'll do a song. That scared me. Hey, what the heck? I I don't know. I just felt like it. Should I turn it off? Okay, I'm turning it off. Turning it off. <laughs> That's really what we need more of here in Galaxy's Edge. I would really like it once the Star Cruiser shuts down. They maybe get more entertainment in here since that budget could just come on over here. Oh yeah, and all the people they hired should perform in there. <laughs> yeah, it would be cool to come in here. All right, here we go. Where are we going? Olga's Cantina. Hi, how's it going? There she is again. It's <laughs> strolling around. There's and here we go. We're, we're checked in? Well, yeah, we're checked in. I did see that cloak guy too. Look. <laughs> it's go time. Tell me some drinks. Get the party started, like Pink said back in the 2000s. Let's get the party started. They're actually calling us. It's us. It's us travelers. Welcome to Guest Cantina. My goodness, I haven't been here in forever. We've only got 45 minutes and we're at the bar, so basically the best seats possible. <laughs> It's been so long. Man, how's it going? DJ Rex! It's popping in here, guys. Thank you, sir. Right on time. What are we gonna get? How are you? Fantastic. Welcome to Premier Sachi Guys with Working Girls Black One too. Is this in here? Yeah, ah. blue No allergies. Fantastic. Just wanted to make sure. Is it our first time? No. Uh, no. Ah, welcome back. You must be experts. You must be, I've got no idea what I'm doing. 
was like, ah. We got the half a boar sampler. It's kind of like a charcuterie board. I don't think I've gotten it before, so we're gonna give that a go. And as far as alcohol drinks, I'm kind of lame and I usually stick with what I like. I love the fuzzy tauntaun. That's always been my favorite. But here's kind of a look at the whole menu. I don't think they've got really anything new. Oh my God, they have cider on tap. <laughs> It smells so good in here. What are you getting, Alexa? Uh, T16 Hopper. Sky Hopper. All right. Jackson goes, are you sure you want the T16 Sky Hopper? So she's not getting that anymore. <laughs> the Jedi mind trick. Like, apparently the Sky Hopper is really sweet. And it's got half and half in it. You guys have ever had Jackson? He's pretty great. Four different cheeses on there. Starting up at the corner is our first meat is chorizo. Oh, let's go. Next to that we have burrata cheese, another form of mozzarella sprinkled on top of some black salt. Pork pate with a blueberry onion jam and a radish. Pork supper. I will as well. That's good. Cheers. Cheers. Looking forward to these side effects, but this thing right here, is delicious. The guava tart is probably one of the best things I've ever had on Disney property. It's delicious. It's so good. I mean, it is really good, but. Can I have it, Russ? Try it with the cheese. Alex and I are like paying way more attention to the snacks than the drinks. It's good. This was an amazing charcuterie board. Looked weird because we're in another planet, but. Um... It was a cool presentation and really up I love Jackson. Jackson's great. There was one piece we didn't like. Blue cheese, disgusting. Not a fan. Kyle said that he was not feeling the numbness, so um, looks like he's getting more. Let's throw some more on there, see what happens. Yeah. That did the trick. I'm feeling the tingling a little bit now on my lips. It's crazy. The, the best spin fizz, that's what I got. Our best spin fizz! Everybody say, ooh! Ah! Enjoy! I really hope you guys get Jackson. Man's a legend here. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> Alexa said she is feeling mighty good, and the reason why she wanted to do that is because she's probably nervous to meet Casey again. What? <laughs> <laughs> I've met her before. She's nervous. Nervous. All right, let's go get Casey. We're gonna go pick her up. There's Miss Jet Fusion walking through Toy Story Land. I miss Jet Fusion? What? Yeah, because you got Jet Fusion in you. <laughs> or Jet jet Fuel. <laughs> she's feeling like she's at Epcot right now. Look at her. Yeah! <laughs> Do a little dance. <laughs> Alexa. What? <laughs> How are you feeling? Great. Stop. <laughs> 
I, had, I chugged two drinks in like 25 minutes. Didn't have to be 25. No, but we have things to do, so I took one for the team and chugged. Are you ever do wreck me? I came in like a wrecking ball. No shot, Mary Poppins? Mary Poppins. Hey, Mary. She's so proper. That's so cool. That's always like a surprise corner. Uh oh. What? Who's over there? Who is it? Casey! Hello there. Hug! <laughs> <laughs> There's just so much side. Yeah, like... Woo! Woo! Welcome, go, welcome eat. back in the vlog. Thank you so much. It's been a while. It has been. It's just been working, but here we are. The new trails end. Let's go check it out. Let's go check yes, it out. I have some mixed feelings. I'm excited for something new, but I'm still sad. Big sad. Big, Big sad. sad. You ready to eat? Let's go. Ready to eat? Yeah. Ready to drink some more? No. <laughs> I didn't even have to tell them to do that, guys. They just wanted to. We're just such huggers with each other. <laughs> Pioneer Hall, let's go. We got an awesome bus driver, Bill. Thanks for watching. Hello, everybody. There we go. His wife's gonna love that. <laughs> Look, they like each other. <laughs> Well, here we go, folks. The brand new trails and completely redone inside. Anybody can come here. It's quick service, just like at any resort. So, we'll see. We'll see. I think yes, there's also like big portions that you can take back, like a yes, like a like family, family dinner. Yeah. yeah. They have. Um, I think there's the tavern, which has the lounge area, and then there's also the trails end part, which is the grab and go and the quick service. Let's find out. Not really too busy at the moment, but welcome to the new Trails End. If you guys remember when you're here for Hoopty Doo, they were still working on this this whole railing. Pioneer Hall Trails End Restaurant. I don't know where we go in. I do want to go up here though, because this is new. I want to go on the new old, the, like the old entrance right here. Let's head on in, check it out. Oh, I can smell the food. Oh, you smell that? Mm -mm -mm. Here we go. Everything is new. Let's see what it looks like. It's opening day. Remember, this used to be a, a table restaurant with servers. Mmm, they got ribs. You can mobile order too, by the way. Oh, we got cooking in the kitchen. Oh, these are gonna be the grab and goes. Ooh, grab and girl ribs. Chili. Here's your green beans, Alexa. Smoke cold pork, so it's pretty much like hooky do. Bread pudding, fried chicken. Pecan smoked brisket. I always say, I don't know why I said pecan. I always say pecan. 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 Gonna have some assortment of chips, lime, barbecue, sea salt, rice chips. I'm sorry, Go squeezes. You know, this is basically standard here. But they also have grab and go pizza, which is new. They also have hand scooped ice cream. How's it going? What's your favorite one so far? Um, actually, I would have to say it would be this one. Right that here. one? What yeah. is that? It looks good. Uh, it's a mixture of different ice creams. It's got a lemon, orange, and lime okay. flavor. Very good. Thank you. And this is uh, sherbet. Yeah. Gonna do a quick scan. This is where the buffet used to be. Right here. This pizza looks good though. Pizza good, Glenn? This is great. Yeah. My favorite is the smokehouse. Gonna have to try that. The smokehouse pizza. Like this doesn't look like regular Disney pizza, you know? 
Like, I mean, obviously it's gonna be a little bit fast food, but looks a little bit better. I mean, look at the look at the ovens out there cooking. In. Anything you, yeah. you you want? I want to see downstairs at the lounge because that's where all like the sliders and the fun drinks were. Okay. Or are. Oh, is this is down there. So here's everything right here. All the different pizzas they have, home style meals which we just saw, and then chicken breast, pulled pork, cheeseburger. I didn't see that, but that's nice. What we got over here? Breakfast. Oh, they did have breakfast. Oh, it's just normal Disney breakfast though. Nothing really special except maybe the specialty coffees oh i did hear that they have um a new, uh, yeah this gold rush gold rush latte one. a strawberry shortcake latte i know oh, it was this one they all sound really good joffrey's too okay all right well what do you guys think of the new trails end again former buffet basically and then turn table side what do you guys think of the change then you just go and check out here. Oh. Oh my gosh, Danish. Oof. Look at the s'mores one. In the middle, do you want it? Oh my god. Maybe later. Yeah. Hot this one. cocoa cookie. They have banana pudding. That's what I want. Oof. All right. I do like how you can just grab ribs. You can grab green beans, which are my favorite now, and brisket. I like that. It's like a hoop de doo meal to go. It's the same kitchen, so I suppose it tastes the same. So do we want to go down there? There's different food down there? I think we should check it out and then make a decision. Are you sure there's food down there? Where'd this guy get strawberry shortcake from? Over here. Okay. I actually did my research this time because I needed to know what was taking over my favorite restaurant. So I the lounge food sounds pretty good. I'm excited to try that. Where we just were is just the enhanced quick service, and down here is the lounge, so you can technically dine on in. He said it's a little bit smaller portions down here and a different menu, so I think we're gonna check the lounge out right over here and see what it's like. That is, uh, so what's happening is you just sit here and they will come to you. So we're gonna do that and we're gonna see what, it, what happens. Because we just saw everything upstairs from the grab and go. But um, here it's like a service. <laughs> <laughs> All right, like, so okay, we'll like, to explain, up there. above, quick service, down below, here's the tavern, and they have a completely new menu. Everything is different down here versus up there. I think hoop do at the quick service, because that's basically kind of what we, we just all saw. Down here, here's a look at the menu, and we're getting one of everything. Because, you know, new food, gotta try it all. Gotta try it all. So here's basically the menu, and we ordered one of everything. Here's a look at the styled plates that we have. Pretty small here. Remember, we ordered all of this. I feel like when I first came in here, I had, I had no idea what I was talking about. I didn't know that there's two separate things, so right on for Casey. Casey for the win. Masada salami. Oh, wait, they're Mickey's. Hiding under those adorable Mickey cornbread crostinis. We no have way. the house pork, Memphis rubbed, both the pork and the... Um... All right, folks, we've got our charcuterie board in it. Check out those Mickey, what is it now again? Is that... I think it's just Christinis. Christinis. Yes. Like little crackers. Like, that is so cute. Get out of here. And then we just got like a whole charcuterie mess, so we're gonna, we're gonna see how it tastes. It's a, it's a charcuterie board. We got more. Let's go, Chase! And they also brought the um, the dessert trio here already, which is uh, s'mores, strawberry shortcake, and a banana pudding. Oh my goodness, look at these fries! We got so much, guys. We are pigging out. Chase, you rock. Fried green tomato sliders. We got a lot of food. We've got the crispy cauliflower here with garlic aioli. And these are the other. Here's gonna be the chicken bites with fries. And we've got um, the buffalo, right? We got buffalo? No, that's the barbecue. Barbecue? Um, barbecue sauce, blueberry barbecue. You can also get buffalo or garlic parmesan and serve with celery and some delicious fries. These actually look like good fries for Disney. These delicious looking fried tomato green sliders. I think I butchered that, but it looks great. And we we also got a trio of sliders as well with, look at that. Oh my goodness. Kind of looks like we're doing a mukbang right now. We've got a lot, a lot of food. These look amazing. Like, look at that. All right, ready? Which Ready? I, first? I already have the coffee oh. <laughs> 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 Just take it away like 
I'm going for the chicken bite. Uh huh. A hint of blueberry. Hate it? A hint. How do you get I hate it from a hint of blueberry? This is the most unique flavor of the wings that they have for the chicken bites. Um, that's blue cheese. Yeah, that one's better. Go right. Yeah, it does. There is blueberry, but it's not bad. These fries are absolutely delicious. You can tell that it's blueberry. Oh. Mm. Mm -hmm. oh, we're good. I'm gonna try this cauliflower. I'm using my hands. I'm so sorry. That garlic aioli is amazing. Wait a second. We've got three different sliders. Are you sure? That's pulled pork. That's amazing. We've got a chicken slider. This food is great. That is amazing. Hey, can I have that one last one over there? Oh my gosh. Oh my god. Mm -hmm. This is the brisket slider, and it is fantastic. Oh my gosh. I'm actually really mad I have to share this. This is unbelievable. Cauliflower is good too. Kind of a shame that this is actually really far and hard to get to for a lot of people. You know? You have to have the car, or you just go to a resort. You take this resort bus back. This is good. Cauliflower, amazing. Even if you don't like cauliflower, try it. The fries are a step up. Amazing. The fried green, what is it? Fried green tomato slider, amazing. Literally everything is amazing. The blueberry chicken, or the blueberry barbecue, don't sleep on it. It's really good. It does taste like blueberry, but it's not in a bad way. I haven't tried anything else yet, so that's all I got. It's finger looking good. Fried green tomato slider is our very last thing. The sauce on here is really good. I can taste the pickles. Kind of tastes like a fried pickle. Kind yeah, of. Yeah, but like the sauce you normally get with the fried pickle. I normally wouldn't go after this, but with these other options, I probably wouldn't get this again just because that pulled pork. It's not bad, but I personally wouldn't get this again. Fun fact, nobody has touched a charcuterie board. <laughs> kind of had a feeling that would be the case. What's your favorite thing, Casey? I think my favorite thing is this um, pulled pork slider. It was on the trio. Second favorite, I loved the cauliflower, actually. That's I really love the good. cauliflower, too. It's a really um, good plant-based option. Wings for me, and then yeah. the pulled, not the pulled pork. The brisket uh, one. The brisket. But everything was great, even the fries. So good. Alexa? I think I already said, but I liked the cauliflower and the fried green tomato sliders. And now, we have the best part, dessert. This one right here. There's banana pudding, s'mores chocolate pudding, and then strawberry shortcake. Oh my gosh. That's good. This one tastes like Hoobie Doo, but better because there's way more strawberries. Oh, cool. oh that strawberries are good. I don't love the banana pudding, but I also don't generally like that, so probably not the best person to judge this one. That one's just okay. The s'mores one? No, banana pudding. Oh. I liked the s'mores one. That one was really good. Oh. It's good, right? I didn't even get the graham cracker in my bite because I that actually is go cheap enough. I can't believe Let's this is like a quick service. I think my favorite is the s'mores, which normally I'm a big banana pudding person, but mm, s'mores one is my favorite. I like the strawberry shortcake. This one is better than Hoop Doo. I know. So Hoop Doo's slacking. I feel like the one at Hoop Doo is a little bit dry. Yeah. Uh, this one is like definitely the strawberries with the side of the shortcake versus yeah. the other way around. <laughs> it's amazing. Strawberry, s'mores, banana. And that marshmallow on the s'mores is like one that you would make on, at a campfire. Like I guarantee they like blow a torch it or whatever. When you guys come here, request Chase if he's here. He was amazing. Awesome, awesome. awesome. Amazing. Great service. I thought he was coming. I was like, speaking of Chase, he's right here. <laughs> He'll be here soon. What a man.
Trails End, without doubt, has some of the best quick service lounge food here on Disney property. So nummy. Called, so nummy. It's called like the Crockett the Tavern. Crockett Tavern. Crockett Tavern. We love but you. But slash Trails End. <laughs> we do love you. It's so good. I'm yep. gonna think about it every single time. Yeah, I still have some <laughs> wing sauce on my fingers. Yeah. <laughs> Saving it for later. So with that, we'll see you guys tomorrow and uh, check out Trails End here. It's so good. 12 out of 10. Bye bye. 100 out of 10. Okay. You. Bye bye. Bye bye. Jump around. Jump around. Jump around. And that's it.